The Shocker softball team is on a five game win streak and as Julia Labina details, they have two hitters that are contributing to those wins and are touching the bases on some national recognition. Addison Barner, another home run, a two run shot for Sydney McKinney. In our conference, I, I don't see a, a duo that's as good back to back in the one two spot. A duo that leads the American Conference in home runs. Just power and ability, athleticism, speed, they've got it all and it's really fun to watch them. Junior Cindy McKinney and sophomore Addison Barnard are leading the way, not just here in Wichita, but nationwide. Cindy McKinney, another four hit game last McKinney, night. the 2019 Conference Player of the Year, ranks second McKinney in batting average. Center. Well, she can hit about almost every pitch there is. Um, if it's 10 feet in the air, she'll find a way to tip it off. And Barnard is following suit. The two of us understand the same pressure and understand what we both have to do and you know we're always trying to get to the next level so I think just having her on the team and just being able to push each other in the most positive way has been a big help for both of us. And the feelings are mutual. She's just always there for me and she it has so much experience and is so good so just getting advice from her is awesome because sometimes I'm going through a slump or making an error and she's just right there to pick me right back up. No slump in sight for Barnard. This past weekend, she became the first shocker in program history to record 20 home runs and 20 stolen bases. When those two do well, our program's probably going to win that game. And I think they've handled that pressure pretty well and, you know, look forward to seeing some accolades. Pressure doesn't seem to be an issue. The shockers are hitting their stride and inching closer to that number one spot as they head into the final stretch. Here for you, Julia Labina. KSN Sports. The Shocker team on a roll. They open a three-game series at home with Memphis tomorrow night. All right, thanks, Alec.